in this lecture again we will uh, go with our motion twin so we will now see about all different kind of twins so we already read about position twin okay and then there was shape twin okay we increase the size now many things can happen at the same time so your shape can change your skewness rectangle is like this after some time it should become like this so how can that happen angle change shape can also change and so on everything together how to change so this will be our objective of this particular lesson so let's start with a rectangle so we have let's choose some other colored rectangle green rectangle okay so we have a rectangle here and we create a motion twin okay and okay again i have not converted it into a symbol okay so first i convert it into a symbol so this is rectangle now what i do i create motion twin and then i want this time that it should now come here and it should become bigger also and it should become vertical in the end instead of horizontal so how to do this okay so let's try to insert a keyframe here so when i do that i will bring it here okay this is the first step and i want that it should become vertical so choose this free transform tool and i will if you do like this and let us rotate this like this so it is rotated let's rotate a bit further this is rotated now i also want that it should become grow bigger also so so you do like this so it becomes bigger also and now so you see it's here now small and sleeping okay so it's horizontal and finally it is becoming so big and vertical so in between now i'm not doing something your flash will decide okay how it goes from this horizontal one to this vertical one and becomes big so now you can see flash has started doing something so how will it interpolate it is becoming little little angle it is making okay it's becoming bigger and it is becoming vertical okay so this is how flash has done animation for you so you can see this okay so this is the thing so see and we can see it from here also test scene so this is there in fact you can change the color also so color effect is here so the color is now this one but i want okay that the color should become yellow okay and i drop from here okay so drawing is not supported here okay so how to change color that we will see in our next lecture but some brightness and all you can always increase so brightness i can make like this 66 percent and then let's try to see so it's becoming brighter also okay or you can make it darker so final frame i'm making it like almost black so you can see so this is changing color also so so many things are happening it's sleeping here horizontal it becomes vertical it becomes an angle changed it became bigger the color changed and everything was interpolated so color also is changing slowly so this is all you can do with your tween now one thing that is left is rotation also so i haven't added any rotation okay so let's add one more thing called rotation so if here you see the properties rotation so what i do one time of rotation also let's add and let's see what is happening so it is while it came from here to here it rotated also once okay so this is happening after you add rotation here in the properties for this motion 
okay so here you come in the motion you that create here you put on the timeline you will see rotation and this happens you make it three times so let's see now what happens so many three times it overall rotated in between okay so that's there but let's remove the rotation you put zero rotation now it will not rotate so this is there for your motion twin i hope you understand now everything about motion twin so thanks a lot